Evening, a political shocker today in Claremont County. An incumbent county commissioner is yanked off the May primary ballot because of problems with his nominating petitions. This means that David Ubel cannot run for re-election. Local 12's Jeff Hirsch has a closer look at what went wrong. Behold the simple nominating petition. To run for office, you need a certain amount of signatures, the number depending on the office. When David Ubel handed in his petitions, everything looked fine at first. But some of Ubel's critics looked more closely and found the petitions had a problem. I don't think it's a technicality. I think it's part of a pattern of abuses that have taken place in Claremont County by elected officials. Chris Hicks, a Republican primary candidate for county auditor, and Tom Bixler, a primary candidate for commissioner against Ubel, filed the complaint. Under Ohio law, people who collect petitions must witness every single person signing the document. A county resident named James Kidwell collected the petitions for Ubel. Most of the signatures came at a Republican endorsement meeting January 17th. But five signatures came on other days. Kidwell testified he never collected those five. Are you saying, sir, you would not have gotten any of those signatures? Everybody knows that knows me that I was in Florida for six weeks after the day after the endorsement. So in other words, you're, the answer to my question is yes, you would not have gotten those signatures dated not, after. No, my arms aren't that long, sir. <laughs> Kidwell said he gave the incomplete petition to David Ubel. Kidwell said Ubel told him he would take care of it. The Board of Elections threw the petition out meaning Ubel did not have enough signatures to qualify to run. David Ubel is not only an incumbent county commissioner, he is also the chair of the Claremont County Republican Party. This county is overwhelmingly GOP, but clearly this dominant political party has some internal disputes going on. I think there's a lot of things we can do to move the county forward. Uh, first and foremost is having a commissioner in there that's honest, uh, has integrity, and it's transparency for the citizens of Claremont County. The Board of Elections, two Republicans and a Democrat, voted unanimously to disqualify Ubel's petition. And I'm really pleased with the Board of Elections because we're seeing that the laws apply to all of us equally. County Commission candidates in Claremont County this year needed 50 valid petition signatures. When one of Ubel's petitions was disqualified, that knocked him below the 50 signature threshold. Commissioner Ubel was not at today's meeting. His attorney was, but I had no comment. Back to you. Jeff, thanks very much. With Ubel off the ballot, there are now four candidates in the Republican primary for that commission seat. Tom Bixler, Michael Collins, Claire Corcoran, and Doug Young. Chris Hicks is running for auditor against incumbent Linda Fraley in that same May 8th Republican contest.